Hi beautiful angels. Welcome to the Divine Guidance by Renu. My name is Renu and I'm a intuitive tarot reader. Uh today I'll be doing reading for a which miracle is coming to your life soon coming towards you and I have a four piles to pick from. Pile number 1, 2, 3, 4 or you can choose the flowers here. The yellow, purple, pink and the red one take your time you can meditate and pause the video uh, to intuitively pick one of these piles or you can pick more than one for sure and the time stamps are given below in the description block, uh, box and let's start with the pile 1 and let me remove the other piles from here so hi pile one who choose this yellow flower so the first card over here we will check the current energy what is happening in your life right now so let's see so very beautiful card creative expression that you're going through a transformation that's for sure i can see that's lots of lots of butterflies at the back and you can see it too so you are going through a transformation so so you are also getting so many creative ideas but you are just uh, getting confused which one to follow or maybe you're already working on journaling those ideas or taking action writing in journal or maybe it could be any kind of creative activity that you are participating or thinking of started initiating or um getting lots of uh, you know creative hints inspirations spark those kind of thing or it could be a sudden inspiration if you are not still getting it so it may be the miracle for you that you're going to get just a sudden inspiration and you will start working on that and you will be like i know what to do so over here i can see that you're preparing yourself to as execute those ideas you're going to definitely taking action you're definitely initiating a creative project soon very soon yellow color is also for the creativity solar plexus chakras color so let's see a uh, very beautiful card because it's a uh, the magician the magician is also about creativity about manifest so you have all the tools you have all the tools you want to manifest you want to work on that and you're going to be taking the action you're going to manifest uh whatever the project you want to work on you want to finish it or display it or show the world your creative talent that is that is your miracle that it is coming the inspiration coming you have to just take the action about it the thing is right now you may be in this struggle that lots of ideas so you getting confused you're not that confident of which one to go for so it's like it doesn't look like uh, for me the exterior uh, external um, external conflict this is more like internal conflict which one uh, i should pick and you can see that she is thinking not uh not expressing not working on the project right now she just into the you know contemplation that oh what should i do right now i have a lot of ideas i don't know which one to follow so it's like a manifest you can do that so focus on one and start with that project so the miracle will be sending you a creative spark that creative inspiration that you can just start just gonna take a sudden action 
and definitely you will be able to manifest that so that's the miracle is happening in your life so you're not gonna you will be out of this energy not gonna get confused what to do or uh, internal conflict you will be out of that and you will be able to manifest that so number one so you able to manifest your new life your new beginning in creating something in creative expression so definitely you are ready to express yourself so the blue color i can see a lot of blue here the blue color is also for the uh, blue and purple for the crown chakra for uh, expression for your throat chakra so for self-expression whatever you want to express through your creativity so that is definitely coming in sorry for that So five is also change. So once you finish uh, like out of this conflict, you will be able to, able to make the change and manifest those ideas. So I have also picked, if you have any question from the angel, I've also picked the angel oracle answer cards over here. So you can pause the video and ask the question if you have it for angels. So here we go improving health what i can also feel that you are also working uh, on some spiritual practices while like manifesting um for you and your kundali is awakening that's what i can see over here if you see carefully in here your kundali is awakening that's why i think you're opening to your spiritual gift opening to your creativity so this cup is Cup is for the emotions, but cup is also for the creativity. So the creative expression is coming due to the Kundali awakening. So as you can see that her upper chakras from crown to the other chakras uh, are opening. So when these chakra open, you connect with the divine energy and cosmic energy, and then you start getting all kind of inspirations. So that's a beautiful card that go with your um, creative expression over here. So definitely you guys are very creative. You just need to come out of this and then miracle will happen. Definitely you will be able to manifest a very beautiful projects or um, whatever you're working on. It's, it could be anything like singing, dancing, uh, painting, anything you will be able to or communicating helping people with your communication so it will open for you uh, definitely so if you were also uh, uh, concerned about your health issue and you will f feel warmth if you're awakening the kundalini so you will feel the warmth uh, in your body in your all chakras over here as you can see there what will it gonna do it will definitely it's gonna improve your health and plus it will open your spiritual gift it will open your creativity so your talent you so uh, you think that oh i don't have it you don't uh, have enough confidence about it you don't know how to move ahead with it but definitely it is happening so this miracle is happening like it's gonna be sudden beginning of something new cycle your uh, that you always wanting to be a creative person and it this is happening this is happening very soon and it's gonna be just uh it just uh, will take a moment aha moment and you will know what to do in your life with this creativity so thank you thank you so much pile one very beautiful pile and please like share and subscribe to my channel and let me know in the comment section how do you uh, how does it resonate with you so thank you thank you thank you so much let's move on to the pile two now hi pile two so we will check this is a reading for uh, what miracle is coming soon in your life and we will check first what you're going through right now what kind of energy you have it what kind of situation you are in right now so letting go so you are letting go uh so many things though those are not serving you toxic people toxic behaviors toxic beliefs um uh, you know old patterns so many things old uh, habits you are letting them go 
from your life. You are easily, purposely, mindfully, one by one, you're letting them go. So that is what is happening right now. Are you planning to do that? And it is going. So you are releasing all those. Definitely. You will be able to release those one by one. You don't have to hurry through this process. It is happening for you. So right now you are into this energy of letting go of old. So you can let in the new energy, new people. So what kind of miracle is happening in your life right now and coming towards you? It's a princess of swords and six of swords. You are planning you are planning to communicate with this person who brought a storm in the past. You see the storm at the back of this person? Who brought some like stormy energy into your life? And also as you can see that the leaves are all over her in this picture too. So it's like an effect of this storm that is happening at the back of this person. He left you through this through the storm, you had been through so much because of this person in your life. So you are planning or thinking of letting him go because it's a card of letting go. So this specific person in your life that is a very toxic person, that's a very deceptive, manipulative person, and you are planning and actually if the miracle is uh, you guys actually seeing him leaving, that is the miracle is happening. You are seeing him leaving your life. It's been a long time you're thinking, you're observing his behavior, you're planning, you're thinking, like not able to take the final decision. But right now, you are actually physically seeing him go, go from your life, leaving your life. So that is what is happening for the pile too. That's the miracle that you've been thinking for such a long time and it took you understand that the, the pattern going on and on in your life and also it took you so much time of getting that confidence to uh, or, you know, stand up for yourself and plan for that and actually taking you know, action towards that to finally see and happening, to see him go, leave your life. So that's what is happening for the pile too. So the angel answer card over here is the look for a sign. Yeah, the universe is also showing you some signs on the way that how to do it, when to do it, when to communicate, how to communicate. So this is a very, both of the cards has a sword energy. So it's a lot of, lot of in your thinking. So it's, it's like keeping you stuck in somewhere mentally so much that universe is also sending you the sign that let him go. Showing you the sign, lots of sign during your dreams. During the day with the light orbs you might see because angels are around and showing you the sign that you have to do it and go ahead, do it. And this is a miracle that you're going to actually finally going to see him leaving your life. So sitting over there and seeing him leaving. So that is the miracle is coming for you pile two. So thank you, thank you, thank you for watching Pile 2. If you like it, please like, share and subscribe to my channel. And let me know in the comment section that which pile resonates with you and how does it resonate with you. So thank you, thank you, thank you so much. Just let me know just a pile if you don't have much time to write down but please uh, to type. Please, please, please let me know which pile resonates with you. So thank you, thank you, thank you so much. Bye for now. Let's move on to the pile three. So 
Hi Pile 3, so the reading is for what miracle is coming soon or entering in your life and if you choose this pink flower, so this reading is for you Pile 3 and we will check first what kind of energy you are in right now, what is happening right now. Uh, uh, in your life what is the situation right now so that you would know that it, this pile is for you because you would know what you going through presently in your life so you can go ahead and then uh, it would like surely it would resonate with you so let's start with the first card over here the current energy is kindness what I can feel over here, you're getting, you are an empath, strong, strong empath over here. Look at your face, it's so kind, calm, warm, and uh, full of love, full of joy. So you are definitely an empath, strong, strong empath, who have a lot of kindness and love for all living beings. And you could have a like, a uh, very strong relationship with the animals as you can see that she is holding the bunny here so you have a strong strong uh, relationship with the animals so what is opening uh, uh, happening here that you are getting more and more sensitive because you are opening to the spiritual gift over here so or you're opening to your soul path if you are like soon be wanting to work for your soul purpose so over here you're opening to your soul purpose so that's why your sensitivity is increasing these days so that's what you're going through uh, that is your present energy so let's move on to the next card seven of sword Four of Pentacles, Two of Chalices. Okay, so you, uh, <coughs> excuse me, uh, you have somebody in your life that holding you, although he is or she is um, manipulative or the third party involved deceiving you, manipulating you, lying to you. So, but you still holding into that person because you're such a kind person. You're such a uh, strong empath. You don't want to hurt anybody. You don't want to hurt anybody's feeling. So you're still holding on to that person, although you know that what kind of this person is in your life. So the miracle is that don't hold, let it go let it go so you can bring the true love in your life that would help you grow spiritually emotionally mentally you can grow and uh, get such a true love and you know soul connection or happiness so that's uh, being empath is really really hard to let go of that person from your life because you don't want to hurt anybody's feeling involving in this relationship uh, so that's why you are ignoring that ignoring that decision and let, not letting that go or like you may uh, you might be just um, concerned that will that person is letting you enough resources with you so that it will be easy for you to survive alone so that might be holding on to that energy holding on to that person holding on to that money it could be anything you're holding on this energy you could be you are might be manipulating yourself internally and ignoring that fact that it, this energy is not good for you if you're not letting this go, how this will enter into your life? 
so this is the miracle i think that is coming into suddenly you will be able to out of that energy suddenly you will be able to let it go you will uh, not hold on to uh, it anymore and this miracle is coming this is happening soon into your life so this is bringing lots of happiness growth you see that all the flowers over here the big flower and all the flowers on the side they're blooming blooming with the love happiness abundance so the miracle is you have to go let go so that this miracle could happen to you and this is happening very soon i can feel that and how you can easily do that doing this trusting trusting the universe they are with you they are supporting you you see that such a beautiful card you have to just invest the trust for now in the universe in your god that everything will be okay you can survive alone you will have resources you will get justice out of this situation you have to just trust the god let it go and let this come in this energy come in this miracle come in into your life so definitely i can feel that you will start trusting the universe and soon letting this come in in your life so this is the miracle pile 3 this is the miracle for you this is the miracle for you and i think you have this person is also help you uh, on your soul soul path so if you're wondering what is your soul purpose what is your life purpose this will help you so you have to go through this into this and this also when bring the happiness abundance into your life and your gift will be open your soul purpose your life path will be open for you to, and bring up so much clarity you have to just trust trust the universe so that's it pile 3 and uh, thanks for watching and please like share and subscribe and let me know in the comment section how does this pile resonate with you and thank you thank you thank you so much and see you into the next video thank you so much so let's move on to the pile 4 hi pile 4 if you chose that red flower over here this pile is for you and um we will check pile four first of all we will check what is your current energy what are you going through right now and then we will check what is the miracle coming into your life so the first card over here is the miracle healing since you picked the red flower so i'm wondering if you are uh healing your uh root chakra so definitely you guys are going through a uh, deep deep healing you might be healing yourself connecting with the different uh, teachers online or taking healing sessions uh, going in person with the uh, to the holistic healers and getting the healing done and there are lots of lots of kind of things i'm doing the meditation or mantras or guided meditations for the healing or the reiki you can uh, watch the reiki videos on online on youtube um, to get the healing energy so you guys are going through intense intense and deep healing over here that's what i can feel definitely let's move on to the next card here nine of swords seven of chalices and what is happening over here for you guys that you have been in the dark energy for such a long time look at this card such a dark energy you had been not right now because i can feel that you're going through healing right now so you were there in this um, dark space for such a long that was so much of mentally uh, stressful 
uh, because it's a swords energy over here and uh, i think uh, so many people around you were sucking your energy they were such a uh, uh, you know mean manipulated people that were uh, just uh, you know uh, attacking on your spiritual energy your aura your beautiful uh, positive energy and you are real running from those because you are healing healing and you want to heal properly so you have to leave this dark place if you are still in there you have to leave that dark place so you can you know uh, complete that healing and also forgive the people forget the situation forget and forgive the people for that what they have done to your life to you so in order in order to fully fully heal fully forget and fully uh, you know forgive you have to move out of the space and enter into that space look at that so you are going through transformation as you can see that Seven is also for the spiritual. You might be on the spiritual path. You feeling that freedom. Look at that. You're going through that transformation. Coming out of this. This is the miracle is happening for you. For pile four. That you are coming out of that dark place. And feeling this. Look at the beautiful colors in this picture. It's a very beautiful car. Enjoy. Look at the look at the freedom. Look at the joy. Your face. That is the miracle. You don't. You have been in that energy. You kind of forgot this kind of energy. You don't need anything to be in this. You just have to get out of this and to be in this full of joy, full of life. Look at that. Look at the beautiful car. Beautiful colors. So definitely you coming out of that, that is a miracle is happening. Uh, anyway, you will find the way to get out of that energy and give yourself your mind, body, soul, that freedom. And fully embrace that spiritual transformation here. That's for sure you're doing it. So that is the ultimate happiness I can see that for you, pile four, when it is happening. So this is the miracle is coming. As soon as you're coming out or you're deciding or you're planning to do that, you will be able to enjoy that. That is the miracle for you, pile four. So you can fully embrace the joy of life, the freedom of life, the spiritual path. And let's see uh, if you have any question, you can pause the video and ask right now from the angels. And I'm revealing the card. And this is no. I think you are uh, still, you may be very uh, kind energy. You have a very kind energy or empathetic energy that you're still thinking of, you know, staying in that place because you care for the people. But I think you have been called. Look at that. Look at the angel over here on the corner. She's saying no because she's asking you walk alone on your spiritual path. You are being called to do that. You have to leave the space so you can enjoy your spiritual journey. Embrace that all the gifts. Embrace that joy, that happiness. You have been here for such a long time. You need that. You need that so that you can, you know, help other people, help yourself, heal yourself. And then later on, you can help other people. So it's like universe is asking you, calling you out, come out of your comfort zone, come out of that dark energy and embrace that happiness and joy. You're being called to do that. So no, or it could be any question that you have it. It's more, I feel like uh, you are not um, fully uh, decided that to come out of this comfort zone. That's why your question is about that. But the universe is saying, no, you have to embrace that 
that energy, you have to come out of that dark energy. So that's the miracle for you, embracing your spiritual journey, embracing your, uh, you know, freedom. That is a miracle coming for you, Pile 4, in your life soon. And thank you, thank you, thank you so much, Pile 4. And see you into the next video. Thank you so much. Bye for now.